I'm gonna take a privacy test. It's right here. Okay. Give me love, give me all your love, oh, cause I want you. Can you no see that? One else <laughs> makes me feel this I'm gonna have three kids. and good morning today is saturday november 19th 2022 and um i'm drinking my red raspberry leaf tea i've been up since 4 30 a.m i woke up with some contractions i don't think i fell asleep ever since maybe like a little bit here and there um but it's 9 27 right now i was having i think i guess it's just like early labor because i was just having like mild contractions and they were not consistent and not frequent enough um and now i haven't had one in like 30 minutes <laughs> so um brandon went to work today so i'm here with the kids i made them breakfast we made bacon and eggs and toast and now i'm drinking some red raspberry leaf tea i put on some makeup i'm just gonna go about my day and um hope that things can progress on their own when the timing is right they definitely felt like real contractions they were in my like, lower back and that is like where like real labor contractions come from usually for me so um yeah i think we're gonna go on a walk it's cold outside it's like really cold outside but i think we're gonna go on a walk now so maybe things can pick up maybe i don't know <laughs> but i just want to stay active today and moving in hopes that the contractions come back and they keep going and stay consistent i'm 38 weeks and two days pregnant um, I had Lennon at 38 in one day and I had Luca at 38 in four or five days. So this is like the regular time for my babies to come. So if this one wants to come, it's welcome. <laughs> so I think this will be the start of my birth vlog, hopefully, if things happen. I'm very excited. I will give you guys a bump shot. Oh, I kind of feel a contraction coming on now. Mama! Yeah, honey? I am on a walk now. Who's on Thomas Us? Yeah, I'm gonna get y'all dressed and then we go out on a walk. Who's on Thomas Us, Mom? I'm having a contraction right now. Who's on Thomas Us? Uh, just us. Just us? Mm-hmm. They're very mild, but I just I like to fully absorb them. But definitely, like, I mean, they're mild, but it's still pressure on my back. I'll show you guys a bump shot. I feel like my bump has not been that big this time around, which is kind of funny. I don't know. Okay, so that's with the shirt. And here is... My baby. Baby bump. <laughs> For 38 weeks and two days. Today is November 19th, 2022. On a Saturday. <laughs> Are you excited to meet the baby? Yeah. Do you think it's a baby girl or a baby boy? I like a girl. You think it's a girl? Yeah. Do you think she's gonna come today? Uh, yeah. Or tomorrow? Today. You think today? Yeah. Can I kiss? <laughs> you wiped my kiss off. No, it's Tuesday morning. And then took off Wednesday and Thursday and Friday. Right, guys so little update I don't think I filmed anything for a while now um, we went on the walk earlier and then I had to run an errand and then we picked up some lunch with my sister um, Brandon's still at work it's 1 55 now I was in disbelief that today was gonna be baby day because the contractions like really just died down they were like every 10 to 15 minutes and they weren't intense or anything so we came home we ate lunch i put lennon down for a nap she was like talking for an hour i think she finally fell asleep but i made some chicken salad because i wanted to have something to eat like if i do have the baby afterwards so i made that it's super easy and quick and luca has been watching tv i came on here because the last i don't know like hour 
the contractions have like upped in intensity and they do feel more intense and I kind of have to breathe through them a little bit more and they're about four minutes four minutes apart I don't know it's never consistent I just don't know but I'm thinking about four minutes apart for like 30 seconds each 30 to 40 seconds each so I'm thinking things are progressing I've been on and off the toilet as well TMI but um but yeah Brandon's on the way home I'm gonna lay down for a little bit maybe we will see I'm feeling really tired like not like physically tired but like sleepy because I woke up at four in the morning so we will see I don't know what the last thing I vlogged was, but <laughs> the contractions are lasting a minute, but the consistency of them is not like consistent, like the timing of them. So like some of them will be like five minutes apart, some of them will be like nine minutes. So I'm a little confused on what my body's doing, but they're a minute and I can't talk through them when they happen. It's very uncomfortable. Yeah, we're working through it, but I've been texting the midwives. My mom is actually coming over soon just in case she doesn't want to miss anything <laughs> but yeah that's where we're at it is 4 32. yeah see this is where i'm at they're just like they're a minute long but they're not the timing is like so crazy. Just in case. What's that? Y'all should probably make the bed just in case when my, when my mom gets here. Make our bed. With the shower curtain? Okay guys, it is 5.37. Contractions are a minute long and about four to five minutes apart, four to six minutes, it really varies. But the midwives are on the way because they just don't want to miss anything if something happens. Um, and my mom is here, so we got the birth bed ready. Yeah, I think it's number three. 
They stayed about two to three minutes apart, lasting uh, over a minute from picking up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 
Did my water will break when I'm pushing or something? A lot of times <laughs> it does, wait. Okay. Uh, Baby can come out in the water too. Uh, Laying down, whatever feels okay. Sick. You still feel sick? Okay. your water breaks. If you are fishing and your water breaks, it'll go just like a water balloon. Okay. But if it doesn't, you know, baby, can you come yeah. in the sack? That would be cool, too. But yeah, this is just a case. <laughs> if you just, I mean, if you feel that pressure, it's just push. listen to your body. Yeah. Okay. Brennan, see? Oh. You want to see? Yeah, I can see. Oh, 
Hardly make a mess, Emma. Yeah, there's, there's like no mess. mess. Where's all the mess? even 24 hours old. <laughs> Do you see her, Lennon? Is that your sister? Mm. Cheese. Is that your baby sister? Yeah. Yeah? Her name is Isla June. Cheese. Yeah. You guys are going to be best friends. Uh, yeah? I don't have Okay, welcome to the world, little girl. Hello, you guys. It is the next day. It's been a little crazy hectic as you can imagine. It is 4.53 p.m. on the next day, so it hasn't even been 24 hours since little baby girl was born, but we've just been relaxing at home. Chilling. I've been super, super tired because she kept me up all night cluster feeding, so I didn't get much sleep, but, um, but the kids love her. 
and she is so sweet she's actually been sleeping a lot more today so um the birth went really really good maybe we can do like a sit down birth story video but it like it just like slowly progressed all day and i was not sure if it was going to be baby day or not until like around two or three when it started to pick up and then all of a sudden like before we knew it everything happened really fast the midwives were only here for like two hours before she was born. I think I pushed maybe like three or four times and she was out. And it was just such a surreal <laughs> moment. <laughs> mm. But um, yeah, we had a beautiful home birth and couldn't ask for anything more. Yeah, she was born at 7.49 p.m. on November 19th and she weighs 7 pounds, 4 ounces, 20 and a half inches long. And she was born at, I was 38 weeks pregnant in two days. So I guess my babies all like coming when I'm 38 weeks. <laughs> yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this birth vlog. Of course, I will probably be vlogging um, newborn life and mama three life. So make sure to subscribe and stick around like this video. And we will see you guys later. Bye. Closer, I want to stay here with you.